So today I'm going to talk about an editing mistake that I see even professionals make sometimes. There's nothing technical about it. It's just the mindset that you have when you're editing, but it really affects your editing a lot and even like the whole direction that you're going at the end. So here's the problem. A lot of editors, they actually show their first rough cut or their finalized editing to a lot of irrelevant people. So I'm going to give you an example that just happened recently. A good friend of mine, he's making an ad for a uh, coffee making machine. And it's a very high end, high technology coffee machine that 90% of their target audience are men. When he was kind of done with the editing, he just casually asked one of our coworker, which, which happens to be a woman, to look at the editing, you know, see how, how she felt about the commercial. She gave some comments about the, the whole video in general, and the whole comment was kind of negative. The comment that she made really affected my friend's direction and how he see the whole editing that he made. And I'm pretty sure that you see the mistake right here is that when you're making an ad for a, a group of people, which are your target audience, like there are different cases that, that I'm going to talk about later, but most of the time you're not supposed to show your rough cut or your finalized editing to the people who are not targeted because the comment that they're making might affect your, the whole editing direction. It might affect how you felt about your editing and affect your confidence about your video. The comments that they make are not necessarily mean or the fact that they are not really happy or they don't feel like they want to buy your product already will affect your whole view on your own work. If you're making, let's say, a dress shoe, men's dress shoe commercial, just show it to people who actually wear dress shoe or who, who are thinking about buying dress shoe. And obviously there are cases where, let's say you're making a dress shoe commercial for men, but you're trying to make maybe their partner to buy it for them. And that's a different case. So most of the time when you're making an ad, you really have to know who the target audiences are. And when you're done with the editing, just show it to people who already might buy the product on the first place. But there are times that uh, if you're making, let's say a travel video or something, and you know, some travel video, they like to make this transition like whoosh, whoosh, and like they shake the camera and then cool transition even non-target audience, they can tell you that, oh, after seeing this video, I feel dizzy or, you know, this color looks weird or something like that. You know, these are kind of not really related to the content itself, but the whole visual. So always make sure what are you trying to convey? Like what is the message? What is the story about this video? And who are you trying to reach out to? So yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.